I had a random flashback today about those old commercials that you used to ask on the TV all the time, what would you do with a million dollars? If you had a million dollars, what would you do with it? And today I wanna to use that question, but I wanna flip it on its head Daily D-Lab style. So I gotta give a shout out to one of my colleagues, Case Kunick, who actually asked me this question. He said, Dylan, if you had a million dollar racehorse, how would you treat that racehorse? Not a million dollars cash, but if you had a million dollar racehorse, one of those big beautiful Clydesdales in the Budweiser commercials, or one of those beautiful uh, athletic horses that you see running around the Saratoga or Belmont Stakes racetrack. How would you treat one of those horses? And he asked me a couple questions that I'll share with you guys or I'll actually expose yourself. Now question one, if you had a million dollar racehorse, would you leave it laying down all day in a crappy stall locked in on a couch all day long? Or would you take the horse outside, let it roam around, show off the horse, expose it to some opportunities, let people see what the heck your horse could do? Question number two, uh, would you essentially just leave it starving and emaciated or would you actually feed it? Would you give it broccoli? Would you give it oats? What are you feeding your horse so that it gives you million dollar results? Is it chain smoking Newports and chugging Budweiser's like horses don't do? Uh, how are you feeding it? How are you treating it? Question three, are you creating a smooth path for that horse to walk on? Is the pasture an even keel? Or are you making your horse walk on a freaking mountainside with rocks and mud and it's gonna break its ankle? Are you making a smooth path for it? Another question, how do you talk to your horse? Do you talk to your horse and tell it it's stupid and ugly and dumb and I wish I had any of the other horses or are you petting its mane and telling the horse it's beautiful and it's smart and it's loved and cherished and then the last question is what other animals are you letting your million dollar racehorse hang out with is your racehorse in a stall with snakes and pythons and rats and skunks and other crap and scorpions or are you making your horse hang out with Clydesdales and steeds and the best of its kind here's the tip for you guys you are the racehorse what are you gonna do with it